Well, here we are in, in Seattle, Washington. We're in the shower. More specifically, in Seattle, Washington. About a week and a half into the first tour that, that, uh, that we've done in almost a year and a half, two years. And, uh, man, it's good to be back on the road. We've, uh, we've not been off the road for this long since we started, so... And we're just having a blast and, you know, getting our tour legs back. So, you know... Here we go. interim between our last tour and recording this new record we've uh, we've acquired a new bass player so um, we're right now we're just sort of out here I don't know trying to trying to play a couple new songs see what see what the audience thinks and uh, and you know bring up bring our new bass player into the fold I'm Matt Magioni. I'm in I'm the baseball player for I was in a band called Unpersons and we used to tour around with Baroness all the time. We all go way back, so it's like it's pretty natural to come in and hang out with these dudes, play music with them, and I've always been a Baroness fan. It's been a really easy transition. We're doing two new songs on this tour and uh we're doing uh, Take My Bones. We've been playing two new songs in this tour. Specifically, one of them called Take Your Take My Bones Away. So it's called Take My Bones Away. Not Take Your Bones Away. Take My Bones Away. Take My Bones Away. That's right. Originally called Macaroon. One of the finer points of you know this new YouTube driven age that we live in is uh, some of our fans are watching songs which are as yet unreleased when they're able to sort of figure out what they're about and then they come out to the show and you know every night there's 10 or 15 20 kids singing along to songs that they don't know the words to yet because those words aren't available anywhere other than you know a, a few uh, handheld cameras that you know, from shows that we've played on this tour. So, you know, within the past week and a half, we've sort of seen some of these songs rise in, in, their, in their minor popularity. It's funny, because the album's not out yet, but you still find people singing the lyrics along with you, you know, so they've been, like, doing their research on the internet, I guess. Um, so it's good to see that kind of, uh, that kind of response from, from the public, people who are, you know, that into the band, that they are, uh, you know, already know songs that aren't even Yet. So yeah, so Take My Bones Away was the, uh, was the first song I think that we really, really solidified. Uh, the riffs that put that song together had been around for you know, a couple of years, year and a half, two years before we started actually writing. So that was like the first rockin' riff we had. So we went with that first. And so we've been able to practice it now for the past year and a half. So yeah, we've had a lot of time to warm up on this. By the time the song really got solidified in the rehearsal space was, we called it macaroon because we were eating some really good macaroons at the time. Yeah, John got some good macaroons. Tasty. 